Attorney Ramon Larupay Mozones was born on March 20, 1913 and was the eldest of 10 children of Florentina Larupay and Santiago Mozones from the town of Miagao, Iloilo. He is credited with initiating several firsts in Hiligaynon narrative tradition. Among them, the first Roman Eclef, Mangbong Asapat, or The Magnificent Brute in 1948. The novel of humor, Sitamblot, in 1946. And the first political satire, Tamblot Candidato Man, or Tamblot is also a candidate in 1949. A champion of the Hiligaynon language, he authored a Hiligaynon dictionary and grammar to combat the youth's growing post-war preference for the English language, and co-founded the Gakud ni Sumacuel, or the Knights of Sumacuel, or Sumacuelan, the oldest and largest surviving society of Ilongo writers in the Visayas, Mindanao, and Luzon, of which he was the president from 1948 to 1950. Acknowledged by his contemporaries as one of the three leading Hiligaynon novelists, he shared the honorific title Hari Sang Sugilambong, or the King of the Hiligaynon Novel, with Serapion Torre and Conrado Norado. He held the longest track record in the genre, having authored 62 novels from 1938 to 1992. In addition to the short stories, essays, and poems that he also wrote, he was editor of Hiligaynon and Yihum, two leading Ilongo magazines. He was conferred the Gawad Pambansang Alagad ni Badagtas by the Union ng Mga Manunulat sa Pilipinas in 1988, the Gawad CCP para sa Sining by the Cultural Center of the Philippines in 1989, and posthumously, the Gawad Bonifacio sa Panitikan Centennial Award by the National Commission for Culture and Arts in 1997. The Order of National Artists is the highest national recognition given to Filipino individuals who have made significant contributions to the development of the Philippine arts. The notable artists for literature are Amado V. Hernandez, Jose Garcia Villa, Nick Joaquin, Carlos P. Romulo, Francisco Arcelliana, NVM Gonzalez, Rolando Estinho, Levi Celerio, Edith El Tiempo, F. Sionil Jose, Virgilio S. Almario, Alejandro Roses, Bienvenido Lumbera, Lazaro Francisco, Cirilo F. Bautista, Resil B. Mojares. On the 24th of October 2018, Attorney Ramon Muzones was conferred the Order of National Artists for Literature or Orden ng Pambansang Alagat ng Sining posthumously by the President of the Republic of the Philippines along with Ryan Kayabyab for Music, Francisco Manosa for Architecture and Allied Arts, Resil Mojares for Literature, Larry Alcala for Visual Arts, Amelia La Pena Bonifacio for Theater, and Kidlat Tahimik for Film and Broadcast Arts. Two of Attorney Muzones' novels were translated by Dr. Maria Cecilia Noxin Nava, a specialist in the literature and culture of Western Visayan studies. Her 32-year study on Muzones was instrument in his winning the 2018 Order of the National Artist, the first regional writer to do so in the 45-year history of the award. Many firsts in Hiligaynon literature. He was the first one who did um, uh, a comic novel. The first comic novel, or I think it is the only novel of humor in, in Hiligaynon literature. The history of Iloilo is actually in one novel of his. It's called Malala Magutum. Mm -hmm. which translated in English, he translated it as Malignant Hunger. After I started working on him, he won three national awards, you know, two of them during his lifetime. In 1988, the uh, 
Union ng Manunulat ng Pilipinas, kung pino. This is Writers League of the Philippines. Okay. You won that, the nas that na national award from them. And then in 1989, CCP gave him also a Gawad sa Award. Okay. And then much, much later in 1998, National Commission for Culture and the Arts gave him the Centenary Award. Attorney Muzones was married to Adelaida de la Cruz of Cabancalan, Negros Occidental, and had seven children, Rene, Rex, Rafael, Rita, Raquel, Ramon Jr., and Rui. Attorney Muzones received his Bachelor of Laws degree from Central Philippine University in 1952.